and welcome to FourCornersTV.com. I'm Laura Schweizer and this is the local roundup. It's time to start planning ahead. Tomorrow's your last chance to get the best price for season passes to Purgatory. Head to SkiPurg.com and I'll see you on the slopes. The ski resort may feel like a vacation for locals and tourists, but back in town, locals aren't very happy with vacationers. Officials from the city of Durango are having a meeting Tuesday to discuss vacation rentals and possible changes to its policy. The debate goes both ways. People who own an available home like the extra income, although others say short-term visitors are loud and disruptive, strew trash all around, and occupy much-needed parking spaces. Voice your opinion Tuesday night at 5.30 p.m. at the Carnegie Building. And last night, though, was the last speech. FLC professor Dwayne Smith has held many titles in the community over many years. But after 49 years of grade books and five to 6,000 students, the professor decided to hang his hat. He was somewhat of a legend, serving on Durango's Parks and Rec Board, the La Plata County Historical Society Board, and writing for the Durango Herald. And now he's remembered as one of the most committed professors FLC has known. Mr. Smith, you will be missed. And kids and cigarettes are never a great combination, and now the FDA is cracking down on e-cigarettes. The proposition would ban their sale to minors and require warning labels, as well as federal approval. The true debate stems from whether these battery-powered devices are more apt to entice kids towards tobacco or help adults quit. The FDA also wants to regulate hookahs, pipe tobacco, cigars, and dissolvable tobacco products. And believe it or not, e-cigarettes might not be the riskiest type of technology for kids. Within a week, there have been two kids now who have reportedly gotten stuck in a claw machine. But this one little girl became quite the modern day Robin Hood. She simply crawled into the claw machine and took matters into her own hands, passing out toys to children from inside the source itself. And do you want to eat like the wild animals do? If you're looking for a culinary delight that requires no cooking, no decisions, and is served in an atmosphere of communal well-being, then check out In the Neighborhood, today at 3 p.m. right here on FourCornersTV.com. But if you're looking for something to do this weekend, check out the Home and Ranch Show at the La Plata County Fairgrounds. And don't forget about the Durango Wine Experience, but if you can't make that one, I'll catch you up on the best wines of the world, Sunday morning, no hangover included. Thanks for watching the local roundup on FourCornersTV.com. I'm Laura Schweizer. I'll see you Sunday morning.